Hey everybody, so I have two quick tips. One on how to save fuel and two, how to replace your fuel rod. It seems like uh, people are having a lot of issues with the fuel rods, but to be honest, one of the big issues is people are bleeding out fuel like crazy. So I'm gonna teach you how to do that. First, we're gonna hit you while looking at your generator button. We're gonna hit the tab key. And then if you don't have this zoomed in, you can just use your scroll mouse wheel and uh, hover over one of the buttons and do that. We're gonna set it to 23. You can set it to whatever you want, but the, the, the wording here, if it's kind of messed up, the UI kind of jumps around a bit, but it's called button on state value. I'm gonna set it to 23. That's all I find that works well. And then when we power this on now, it will go to a maximum of 23 versus 100, and you will save way more than four times the, uh, the the amount of power that you need. And basically, it's enough to keep my ship running. And then when you're mining and you know your ship is stopped for a while and stuff like that, obviously you should probably consider turning off the generator because you'll save some power there. So we'll see this go all the way to 23, and now it's capped, which you, know, you can see over here. If yours is at 100, you can see quite the difference how uh, much power it's saving. So we're going to turn that off now and we're just going to get out of our seat and we're going to replace now our fuel rods. So this is your reactor. This is this is where it's all made at my friends and we're going to just hit E. This is the simplest thing ever. So we're going to hit E here. You can discard these or keep them. You can refuel them later on by the way just to let you know but what we're going to do is do that and then we have this snap tool but they're kind of annoying you they kind of like to snap all over the place uh, you can hit c to turn snap off but you do need snap on to get it back on what we're going to do instead is we're going to go ahead and hit x here you can hold uh, z and x and things like that and y so i'm going to use y now to shift it over here a bit there we go it likes to it, it's kind of a little derpy sometimes it's just to be fair, it's probably one of the worst uh, little setups they have for this, but we're going to go here. Let's get a little closer. I, I let go with E again, and then basically, there you go, E. And that's it. And then if we power this on, if we go in here and power this on, there you go. You have full fuel, and we're good to go. So that's as simple as that. One, two, three. And then don't forget, you can take your empty one here now if you wanted to, and you can go ahead and just place this one back on here. Just remember the snapping is C to turn it on and off. And if it's acting up, you can you have to use your Y, hold down Y and move it, and then you can use your X to move it up. And once it works, you just hit E to let go, and now it's back into its holder, and that's it. Now we have a fueled up uh, ship, and we're also saving way more than four times the fuel, uh, so we're not bleeding out fuel too much. So hopefully that was a good tip for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please consider subscribing, commenting, liking for more Starbase videos, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.